everybody, Julie the Whippy Chick here, and it is day 14 in my 31 day series of how to get your yarn organized for the upcoming year. So after Christmas is over, boy, our yarn spaces are kind of a mess, am I right? I mean, all of those gifts that you furiously made throughout December, and there's just probably scraps everywhere. So let's just get ourselves a little bit more organized. Today's idea is a very simple one, and it's a very affordable one, and it's a very practical one. So these closet shelving units are amazing for yarn storage. I actually have one myself, and it's actually made of vinyl, and it has a zipper in it, so it even stays dust free, which is great as well. Um, these units are great for other reasons as well I and mean, you can put it in the closet and close the door and that way little people's hands you know our famous little people who love to play with our yarn and our little pets our little dogs and our little cats and our little furry friends maybe even birds like to get at our yarn and play with it that's not necessarily something we want them to do even though they look very cute doing it right <laughs> Anyway, this is a really great practical idea to store your yarn away tucked in the closet where nobody can damage it or ruin it. And it's also, you know, out of eyesight. So maybe you're um, having tons of yarn laying around is not what you want your house to look like. That's okay. That's how I feel too. I like it tucked away. So this is a great way to do that. There are tons of ideas and places to go to get one of these. You can find them all over the place. You can find them at Target. You can find them at Walmart. You can find them on Amazon. And they're, like I said, they're really relatively inexpensive. They aren't super durable, but that really doesn't matter. It's not like our yarn is super heavy. You know, we're not stacking cinder blocks and bricks on these things, it's yarn. So I think that they're perfect for yarn storage. I hope you do too. I would not be at all surprised to find out that many of you are already using this idea today. So let me know in the comments below, is this something you've used in the past? Is this something you're going to use in the future? What do you think of this idea? Have you had good luck with this? Have you had bad luck with this? all of those kinds of things. And if you just want to pop in the comments and say hello, that's great too. I would look forward to reading from you no matter what you have to say. Well, as long as it's nice. <laughs> all right, everybody, I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you tomorrow for day 15. Bye-bye.